So family, this story comes from New York. Rikers officers, you know, corrections officers, have been arrested and accused of faking illnesses and injuries to stay off the job. And so you have a picture here of Eduardo Trinidad, a Department of Corrections officer since 2013. And as you can see here, you can see this guy claiming that uh, for 16 months, he was unable to work and he had debilitating injuries. But it turns out that his injuries weren't so bad that he could bowl. As you can see, you know, he's he's um, getting some strikes and to do some home improvement work. You know, you, you can't be all that injured, right? Man, this story is going to be delicious. And so these officers... We're doing things instead of working. They were claiming to be injured and sick and everything else. Instead of working, they were in the Dominican Republic in Florida for vacations and collecting full salaries. I mean, you had stuff like people were on the dance floor, right? D dancing, bowling, doing all kinds of nice stuff. Just racking up taxpayer funds for zero work. You had one officer get in a hundred and forty thousand dollars because they were faking an injury an illness you know saying that something that something was wrong with them wow you made six figures doing that man that must be lucrative i gotta say you have stephen cage eduardo trinidad like i mentioned towards the beginning of the video and his fiance whose name is monica coaxum and these people were essentially gaming the system, man. Uh, you had one of these people who decided to take off 18 months of sick leave, right? 18 months to pursue a career as a cartoon artist while drawing $160,000 in salary. Wow, the nerve and the audacity. <laughs> Wow, man, that, that's amazing. You, you got to love it, right? And mind you, all of these injuries, all these sicknesses, they were all fake. None of it was true. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Blue Lives Matter, you got to explain this one. You say that all law enforcement are heroes. Are they heroes too, Blue Lives Matter? I mean, do they count Blue Lives Matter or do only the good cops count? Do these people count too? I'm just curious, Blue Lives Matter. I just got to know.